so the, the other thing that I want to point out is that Celebrity whiskeys should, their pricing should not be compared to the legacy distilleries like Heaven Hill, you know, Wild Turkey, brands like that, because they've owned their equipment for years and years. They have many SKUs to spread the cost out across. They have completely different cost structures. So if, if you are going to say, well, I'm never going to buy a Brothers Bond, which I think is around 40 bucks, um, because I can just go out and get a Evan Williams bottle and bond, you know, 100 proof for $13. Well, all celebrity whiskeys are off the table for you because no, no new brand is ever going to be able to keep up.